Hi guys, welcome to Alan Fix Stuff. So in this video, I will install a new switch for this cheap mouse. Yeah, this is a cheap mouse. But I will install an expensive one that name is Kyle Switch into this cheap mouse. First of all, we need to unscrew the bottom plate. At first, I thought there is a screw under the warranty sticker, but there is no screw. So I've been fooled by this sticker. Yeah, thanks. For this mouse, I need to pry open from the side and the back. For other models, they may have a different way to open it, so you have to look for it for yourself. There is a block of metal in this mouse, it is supposed to add some weight for this mouse. And the name of the switch on this mouse is Boyu. I never heard of it. Mostly I heard of Omron or Kyle. So yeah, this is Kyle and let's compare these two switches. The size is correct and mostly they are just same size for all mouse switches. I will use my electronic solder iron, I set to 350 degrees celsius and I thin the tip of the solder iron, a little bit of solder and put some flux on the solder joint and add some fresh solder to the joint. I use solder sucker to pull out the solder, you also can use solder wick to wick out the solder. It's up to you which one you, will, you would like to use. and the switch are come out nicely. Great.
I hold the switch so it will not fall off and I apply a little bit of solder to hold it in place. After that, I add some more of the solder so that it makes a good solder join. Then, I install the other switch with the same procedure. Finally, clean all the flux residue and it's done. So that is how you install a new switch to your mouse. So is it worth it? If you have an expensive mouse, yes, it is worth it. So thanks for watching and I'll see you again in the next video.